hello all and welcome this is Asa Demak and today I'm going to show you another vulnerability uh, named password reset poison so what it is it's basically uh, password reset poisoning is a technique whereby an attacker manipulates a vulnerable website into generating a password reset link pointing to a domain under their control this behavior can be leveraged to steal the secret tokens required to reset arbitrary user password and ultimately compromise their accounts. Before explaining further, let's see how does a password reset work. So virtually all websites that require a login also implement functionality that allows users to reset their password if they forget it. There are several ways of doing this with varying degrees of security and practicality. One of the most common approach goes something like this. Uh, the first step is the user enters their username or email address and submits a password reset request. The and second is the website checks that this user exists and then generates a temporary unique high entropy token which it associates with the user's account on the backend. Third is the website sends an email to the user that contains a link for resetting their password. The user's unique reset token is included as a query parameter in the corresponding URL. As you can see here, this is an example URL. This is the main and this is the secret token starting from here. And it's not a guessable token. The fourth step is when the user visits, visits this URL, the website checks whether the provided token is valid and uses it to determine which account is being reset. If everything is as expected, the user is given the option to enter a new password. Finally, the token is destroyed. So let's see how this password reset poisoning works. Password reset poisoning is a technique whereby an attacker manipulates a vulnerable website into generating a password reset link pointing to a domain under their control. This behavior can be leveraged to steal the secret tokens required to reset arbitrary users password and ultimately compromise their account. So as you can see here, uh, this, is a, uh, this is an attacker, okay, what he is doing, he is actually uh, somehow managed to find his victims or targets email address and that address is uh, is the address by which this user is registered on this domain this is for instance normal user.com this is the name of this domain and the username is carlos okay so he got his email somehow and now he is going to reset his password now when he clicks on reset password link sorry the button of uh, reset your password then before forwarding uh, this request to the actual domain normal user.com what attacker this attacker is doing is actually uh, tampering the request the entire post request okay he'll capture he'll uh, use a proxy a local proxy and intercept the entire entire request post request and then change the actual domain that is normal user.com to his own domain attacker.net or whatever evil user.net okay and then forward it to check first that if it reflects or not if the request is reflecting then he will uh, further temper the request and then forward and now this for uh, link is then reset link is sent to his this uh, victim's email address that is carlos at normal user.com once he opens the link 
it would be something like this hello Carlos to reset your password click the following link as you can see here HTTPS forward, forward forward slash this is the server of this attacker eveluser.net forwarded by password reset and this is the unique token which uh, which is generated as per request of password resetting so no, now when he clicks on this link the, the uh, his token is sent to the attacker server and he'll see 404 not found or whatever he's uh, the attacker is already set up for him to view
and this is where an attacker put his own server address but for testing purpose I'm going to add this google.com and see if it reflects in the response or not so let me forward this sending as you can see here it says 200 ok request has been successfully forwarded let me search google as you can see here it is reflecting ok now we are sure that this website is vulnerable to password reset poisoning attack so let me again bring here copying this header line copying it and adding under post like this and now going to forward this request as you can see forwarding and yes we are done going to stop this intercept and the background as you can see a confirmation has been sent to your email address please follow the instructions in the email to reset your password great so let me go here okay let me refresh it okay change the preferences to normal input settings no proxy ok going back and yes as you can see here we receive password reset confirmation email clicking here and great as you can see here google.com is here and this one is the secret token right so this is how password reset poisoning vulnerability works now what an attacker do he can set up his own server on his uh, system and the link the email link this goes to victim's email when he clicks once he clicks on this link he will receive 404 not found and let me try this like this and this request this entire token along with the URL goes to an attacker attacker server and he will then reset clicking on it and reset the password of his victim so that's all for this video I hope you like this video